Okay, right, who's starting? Uh, I think it's your turn, isn't it? Okay. No, it's not Shotmaster hasn't done one in fucking ages. Aww. I'm pretty sure it's your turn, though. No, but Shotmaster hasn't done one in absolutely fucking ages. This is going to be in the podcast, isn't it? Fuck yeah, it's going to be in the podcast. <sighs> so you're going to have me groaning about doing the intro. You're going to... You're gonna show me raw. All right, hello, welcome to do, the talk to the you know what? podcast. I am Shock Do you know what? No, no, Shock Mouse. No, I'm do you know what? Shock. No, Shock Mouse. Do you know what? Talk to the hand. Okay, hello everybody, and welcome to the Talk to the Hand podcast. It's already. It's not even fucking started yet. We've already talked to the hand on Shock Mouse. I am with Angry Chip Show. <laughs> oh God. <laughs> good, good day to you all. And my name's Peter Day. Uh, just forget the Australian man. He doesn't exist, because he's a wanker. I'll, I'll, I'll speak for him. Hello, my name's Shock Mouse. I'm a dickhead. There we go, that's Shock Mouse. And this is the podcast, Shock Mouse, you're back. <laughs> Viewers yeah, no, have Shock been Mouse. very concerned about how mean you two are to me. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't do anything. I haven't even said a word. Why am I Guilty getting blamed? By association. Oh, thanks, yeah. I didn't even say a word, but I'm guilty. Okay. That makes per- you. perfect sense. <laughs> Chimp, how was Let's your week? Talk- uh, same old, same old. <laughs> same old shit? Although, yeah, same old shit. Although uh, the car did break down, which was a bit of a pain in the fucking ass. What happened? It broke. Oh, well, okay then! Sorry for asking, Chimp! <laughs> Not a fucking mechanic. <laughs> I thought monkeys were meant to be good at fucking cars! Especially fucking cars. Yes. Let's talk about. Imagine that puppet hanging off the back of a car on the exhaust. (laughs) (laughs) Let's talk let's talk about the vlog series that is Shock's vlog, shall we? Yeah, was Becky what I say was was Becky Boop unavailable? (laughs) What? Do you know what? Becky Boop. Yeah. What do you mean? Oh, don't, don't fucking worry, Shot Mouse. Listen, Shot Mouse, Shot Mouse, don't worry. Don't worry your pretty little heart, okay? It's three minutes, I'm already confused. Shot Mouse. Uh, to, to be fair, he confused me on that one. Yeah, Tell yeah, me. see? Shot Mouse, Shot Mouse, don't worry. Don't worry, just don't worry. It's all alright. I mean, Becky Boop wasn't available. Right, let's talk about your vlog, okay? Let's talk uh, about how many chins are on the camera when you vlog. Let's talk about fucking copyright infringement for a second. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck like you. the copyright infringement that you were infringing that I infringed upon. <laughs> you, w- like you wait, okay, I'm gonna start... Infringing. You're gonna, you, you watch, I'm gonna start a new fucking vlog called The Week Off Again because Peter doesn't fucking get a hint. And, uh, and I'm gonna play the Shotmouth vlog on the TV in its entirety. <laughs> Every episode. Every episode, <laughs> one by one, as a mega cut. <laughs> to be fair, I could, I, 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 I'm guilty of copyright infringement because every live stream I've done for the last three weeks, I've played the Shock Mouse podcast first 30 seconds down the mic. I, I did it on Dylan's live stream the other, the other day. <laughs> really? Really? Eight, ti- eight times. <laughs> oh, it's the new B meme. <laughs> B movie meme. B meme? It's Be- a live stream, except every time Angry Chimp comes into it, you hear the Chuck Mouth podcast. It's new- it was funny because obviously there was a few people that didn't know who you were. And the only people that were laughing <laughs> were me, now. Dylan, and Doodle Tones, because we obviously knew, knew uh, you know, the meme. <laughs> Everyone was like, who's this Chuck Mouse? Just, just some cunt. Just <laughs> some, you know. Just so bo- I directly to your vlog in- channel. Just borderline irrelevance. Yeah, I, I, yeah, I direct them to your vlog channel where you just talk bollocks for yeah. a certain amount of minutes. Right, so Shot Mouse, is this happening? Yeah, it's happening. It's happening. <laughs> it's happening. <laughs> Pete, Pete, yeah. does, do, does your arm ache? My arm it really aches. The camera's it so really heavy. Aches. Chimp, the camera's you know, so heavy. The camera's so heavy. This phone is so heavy. I mean, I'm going to have to carry a baby at some point, and that's going to make even more stress on my arms, Chimp. <laughs> Whatever oh, will well, I see, do? At least I've taken the attention like, off the podcast. Mission yeah, accomplished. By the, by no, the no, 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 no. This is like the podcast 2.0 for you. 
okay? Because you're still talking yeah. to yourself. Yeah. No, I'm not. Yeah, you are. You know what? I'm talking to you. <laughs> you know what? what makes me laugh? Oh, in the right? vlog. <laughs> <laughs> in the vlog. <laughs> <laughs> Every week, every week, I'm like, I'm going to be a smart boy today. This is too and easy! Wonder... This is too easy! And you wonder why people bully you. You know, some people just deserve it. <laughs> some people deserve to be bullied. Look at that one, he deserves it. Look at him. He deserves it's, it. It's gotten to the point now, Shock Mouse, where you're literally just trying to come up with new inventive ways to get, like, your fix of bullying from me and Chimp. It's like it's like some sort of weird kink. <laughs> <laughs> I've got, his, I've got his, he's probably sat there now in fishnet stockings, <laughs> <laughs> high heels. I like Rocky Horror hand. Picture Show. <laughs> <laughs> Tim Curry. You know I'm going to do that in a future video now. <laughs> oh, I can't <laughs> wait. Oh, no. With lipstick oh. and everything. Going to be I, fishnet stockings. <laughs> I can't wait. You know what makes me laugh, right? Tell you what, 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 tell you what. Shot Master, if you do that, all right, I will apologise to you for all of the bad times on this podcast. It would take more than that. What What would you want me to do? I would want you... No. <laughs> Print out flyers and film yourself handing them out to people advertising the Shock Mouse podcast. Oh, I like that. that. Like, like a fucking Jehovah's Witness. I like yes. that. <laughs> Just go out on the street corner yeah. and like, have you heard of the Magnificent Shock Mouse podcast? Accept can they, that can bet. They, can they accept these... that bet, Sh uh, Pete. you got to accept that bet. That's got, this has got to happen. Can, right? can in the these... comments. All right, all right, all right. In the comments, on the ground, put in on the if grounds, you want this to happen. On the grounds, okay, can these flyers include the picture of you <laughs> in, <laughs> in fishnet stockings with lipstick on? Well, hang on. Now, why why does that encourage me to do the bet if you're then going to distribute the picture? Of course I'm gonna do, uh, gonna do that. That's gonna be fucking funny. Not only that, he's gotta then do the thing before you've yes. done yours. Which yes. means, no, man, that means you're gonna fuck him over. Yeah. <laughs> don't try and be, don't, don't try and be a, uh, uh, what the fuck am I, Conan fuck Pete. <laughs> okay, but you do realise how much of a weirdo you would look like handing out those pictures. <laughs> <laughs> Is this some sort of hey. S&M club? Hey, Shock mouse, S and M. Hey, hey, hey Shock mouse, Shock mouse. At least it would be worth it. I'm going to London. I'm going to London this month, right? And Pete. I would happily take some with me. <laughs> yeah, Pete, you do realise that S and M, you know, sadomasochism, Shock mouse. Of course, I know what it fucking now, stands for, chimp. <laughs> Isn't S and M illegal? I'm not in, in Shock England? mouse. Meanwhile, Shark Mouse is writing it down in his big book of knowledge. How? <laughs> oh, S&M is... equals sadomasochism. <laughs> He's Googling it. I never it. knew that. <laughs> Google, <laughs> please tell me. <laughs> oh, dear. So, yeah. So, so I, I would only do that, Shark Mouse, if the picture was allowed to be on the flyer. See, I'm fucking smart, Shark Mouse, okay? I played the long con. Yeah, I are you. Oh, what yeah. you just do is you block your actual face out with a cartoon face. But do I get to do do I get to design the flyer? I get to design the rest of the flyer, but the picture has to be on it. The picture has to be on it. Of me. Of you. But I can put any other picture or text that I want on it. <laughs> now you see now you're gonna say that this is <laughs> <laughs> See I see what you're trying to Are do. Are you a smart mouse. boy? Are you? <laughs> <laughs> I get a, I get at that picture of, I'll get a screenshot of when you were dancing and cat shit and go. These two right. lovers are on Talk to the Hand podcast. <laughs> all right, all right, all right. But tell you what, okay, you you could do that, but I'm allowed to make three edits. Oh, what God, does that this mean? Is you need to, now. to your edits. You need to define the boundaries of the edits. What is one edit to remove everything that I put on it <laughs> minus the picture, and then the second edit is to add text. Shot match, the shot third match, edit is shot to. <laughs> Print it out or something. <laughs> Shot match, you gotta you gotta take that gamble, I'm afraid, dude. That's not a gamble. It is a That's fucking like gamble. Going to the casino and they're like, hey, do you wanna put it if you put it on red, you win <laughs> red on red, you win some money, but if it loses, 
I'll fucking kill you and the rest that's, of your family. Oh, that's, that's a very fantastic. That's the very concept of a gamble. <laughs> I like the odds. <laughs> oh, and by the way, we kill you. We kill your family if you win too. <laughs> Meanwhile, Shot Mouse and his big book of knowledge, Gamble, equals 50-50 <laughs> chance of something good oh, or something God. negative. Mostly negative. Mostly negative? Yes. Right, I'm all for this happening, but I don't think, it, I don't think they're ever going to agree, ladies and gentlemen. I don't, I don't think it's going to happen either. I have a funny feeling. <laughs> <laughs> I have a funny feeling. A funny feeling, huh? Ah, I have a funny a feeling. I have a funny feeling in my loins. Because I've got a funny feeling. Yeah. I've done it. <laughs> I freaked you guys right. out. <laughs> and we're back in the room. <laughs> I-dubs. Made a content cop recently about Tana Mo Mojito or whatever the fuck her surname is. Nobody can fucking pronounce Mojito. it. Mojito. <laughs> yeah, Mo Mo Mark Lovecock. Hello, Mojito. <laughs> oh, Mr. Mojito. I don't know why we're Japanese there. <laughs> <laughs> but yes, um, I thought it was very good, actually. I enjoyed it. If I was to criticise anything about the video, it would be... Um, I found that the editing was a little bit rushed, but he did actually address that and say that he, uh, it, it was a little bit more rushed than what he had to, what he was planning to, mainly because uh, that video got leaked uh, yeah. before he was ready. Um, so he did address it. But yeah, no, I thought the video was very good. Uh, he, he made a very good point about the actual word, um, the context of the word, and basically everyone stopped being pussies. Was the <laughs> was the general. Was the general uh, message? I think it's what I said um, in my. Uh, it's what I said in the I look at official Discord. I said that basically it's the difference between somebody saying it as you know as a joke or as a humorous standpoint and using it to illustrate a point or whatever to somebody using it hatefully in a fucking grotty apartment. Yeah, there is <laughs> there is a big there is a big difference. I don't think um, people. I'm going to just say his name. People like Harlan uh, really. I don't think he really understands that. Like, I, you know, he's trying to get people to change the meaning of the word, but I'm sure, he does use it I'm sure, in a very aggressive way. I'm sure that in one of his videos or on a Twitter post coming soon, he will definitely, definitely say, see, I told you it's not a bad word, and continue to use it hatefully because he won't get the whole point behind it. No, he won't. No, no. He uh, he doesn't get the co the context behind it. But, uh, yeah, so I, I think iDubs... It was a very, very clever video in the end, and yeah. Shock, what else do you want to add to this conversation? Uh, you just want to sit there and pick your ass. I... <laughs> no, I think that the leaking of the video and then her making that rant really, really helped him even further. Like, if it then turned out that they were in cahoots and that they, they hoaxed this whole thing, I wouldn't be surprised because it just worked out so perfectly for him. Not that I think. No, it was a I think I don't think it was a hoax. I think he generally read her. And I mean, he even said it in the video that she's a very predictable human being. He read yeah. her. He knew exactly how she was going to react. Yeah, he knew that she would go and make that video. And video, and make a video, and make it worse. And he knew how he was, he was just going to approach the whole situation. He knew exactly what was going to... He was in control the whole way. Which makes, makes yeah. it so much more sweeter, I think. Because I think you can see that he's just in control. That he's read her, like, 100%, like a book. Like, he yeah. knew exactly how she was going to act. Although I do believe that she uh, she um, she did lose quite a lot of subs, but um, not as many as what people were thinking at first. I mean, that's just mm. sheep mentality. But um, she left a, a couple of tweets saying that she was going to make an apology video and apologise for all the things she's done wrong. And I think a lot of the people kind of um, respect that about her. I don't know what, what you guys think, whether you knew about that. I think she started pushing um, it towards the end when she started saying that, she, that that we'd saved a life or something. I'm like, yeah, all right, calm down, love. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. <laughs> that, that, that's going a bit far. But I mean, that's the best that she, the best thing she can do is take it on the fucking chin and walk away because if she tries to fight it, she will end up like Leafy and Leafy's it's, still plumping now. It's a wake Even up. Even now after that. It's a wake up call, to be honest with you. It's, it should be like a uh, stop being fucking shit. But to stop being uh, stupid, I mean, she's she's attacked iDubs and not understood how he uses the word. 
you yeah. know, because maybe she doesn't watch his content enough. Maybe, yeah, it well, could be a million reasons. Maybe she's just a dick, yeah. which is probably <laughs> most likely. Um, but every time I've watched I dubs and he's used that word and other words, you can see, I, you can clearly see he's using it as a, 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 a as a comedy, or he's just reading it out where someone else has actually sent it to him, or, yeah. or comment or stuff like that. Um, and that's not being racist that's reading something out that someone sent you that's that's just you know uh but yeah i thought it was, i thought it was all very good very interesting do we want to talk about the other one um well i was gonna say i was just gonna say basically that um uh the best comment that i read on the idubs video where somebody said uh, uh that uh, a commenter came over from tanner's channel saying i was ready to give you hate but in actual fact i subscribed you made very good points <laughs> <laughs> says a lot it does yeah it's uh, as i said it it's it doesn't excuse hatred behind words because it's like you could say anything and have a meaning behind it so uh if i said you know like like laughing and joking like like we do on the podcast where i sort of laugh and take the piss out of shop and say guys oh, such it's such a fucking weird australian cunt like obviously i don't mean it because again it's it's the humor behind it and it's the case of trying to be interesting and funny but if I said it with like real malicious, like like such anger, then of course that'd be really wrong of me to do that. Like I'm not doing. I'm obviously not doing that. So yeah, here, here's the grey area of that though. If someone uh, and it, it does happen a lot, especially in YouTube, will be aggressive to someone and then they'll get called out and they go, "Oh, it was just a joke. Oh, yeah. oh, it was just, it was just a joke. I, I, I called I, call, I, call, I called you a nigger. It was it was just it was just a joke. When yeah. maybe it wasn't, you know." Yeah. And there's that there lays a grey area. Like you, you need to people need to judge that for themselves whether whether they believe that or not, you know, at that yeah. point. I mean I'd have said it best um, that all either all of it's okay or none of it's okay. Yeah. Pretty much. I said I mean it's it's us that empower these words anyway. He said that and all, doesn't he? It is yeah. it is us that emp- you know, puts these these gives these words these these kinds these of meaning, yeah. you know. Yeah, that we desperately give don't it want so it to much have. power over people. Yeah. yeah, and nigger is definitely a like a word that has been put up on a pedestal, you know, where others yeah, have it's because it, it's because it's been used primarily as a word that is symbolised with hatred. But that being said, you can you could give words different meanings just by the inflection that you give with those words. Yeah, I mean personally, I don't like the words. No, I, I'll, I don't. I don't I'll, use I'll say it. it. I, I I might use it if I'm if like in this like scenario where I'm explaining it, you know. But I don't use it as an insult. I don't really use it as an as a commentary sense either. I like, refuse. Listen, listen. I refuse to use the word outright. Not because yeah. of uh, not because of anything else, but other than the fact that people see it as racial slander and, and, and hurt. Therefore, I'm not going to sort of get into a fucking argument with people. You're gonna be like, oh, oh, he's 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 being a, a racist cunt and stuff towards people, and like, I I, I just can't be dealing with the fucking like b- uh, backlash and issue that sort of surrounds it, you know. But it, like, I do a hundred percent agree with um, what Idubs is saying and stuff. It's just yeah. where where that where that word has such, you know, meaning. Like again, you'd never hear me saying anything that has been used in a derogatory sense towards somebody. Hmm. That's that's my whole thesis behind it, anyway. Yeah, that's fair enough. I, I, I will use it if I'm explaining it because obviously, if someone's coming into a conversation, they don't know what the fuck I'm talking about. Yeah. <laughs> what word are you if, talking if about? I, if you I, to say if it? I bring it up in conversation, <laughs> I'll just call it the N word. Yeah, yeah. Because <laughs> because you know, like, like, um, immediately when I say N word, that that word goes in, like through your head straight away. Like you just you just fill in the blanks. <laughs> Do you mean <laughs> the weird, great though, country that... called the Netherlands? <laughs> yes! <laughs> That's That's there's so many say. words that begin with N! <laughs> Norwegians. <laughs> there's <laughs> damn Norwegians. <laughs> Back at it again with them white bands. Uh, what else happened this week, Chimp? Zap tie. Ah, oh, zap tie. Oh, do we talk about this? <laughs> uh, yeah, I think, I think we have to. Okay, for people who don't know, um, well, first of all, Zaptai is actually subscribed to both me and Chimp, right? So he watches our stuff, and we're very thankful for it. Um, that that you know that that sort of big names have taken interest in us. Uh, I don't know, Shopmouse, who's the most popular person who's subbed to you? 
Uh, that would be my friend called Funny Maham that neither of you have ever heard of him. No! <laughs> can't even, I can't even fuck. I couldn't even re-say that word if you fucking tried. <laughs> Who is that? Funny Maham? Maham? Yeah, that's pretty much it. Bloody Maham. hell. <laughs> yeah, I was going to say... Funny Maham. I was going to say, uh, like, up until recently, Zaptai was, like, my most pop, uh, popular subs- uh, subscriber as in, like, number of subs. Um... That has since been overtaken by Klossler's Crazy and Tommy C, etc. Um, Will you two shut the hell up? <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> it's just like these baseball cards that you've got. I've got this one. Shot I've mouse. got this got, one. I've mouse. collected Shot a, mouse. I've collected Shot a mouse. Really Crazy and a Tommy C. Shock mouse. Shock what? mouse. I'm jealous, okay? I'm not going to lie. Shock mouse. You should give me a picture. And allow me to do whatever the fuck I want with it when I distribute the picture out to the fucking British public. And then it'll all even... go away. What has that got to do with what we're talking about? Because it'd be fucking <laughs> funny. If you could get Colossal is Crazy to subscribe to me and genuinely love me, sure. Shark Mouse, he only subscribes to people who he genuinely fucking loves the content of. That's the thing. Yeah. You, like it's like asking it's like it's like asking me right let's say that justin bieber was a small youtuber right and saying oh peter day should subscribe to me because i, I, I just generally show me love i'm not gonna it's like you i'm not gonna fucking like watch somebody who i don't fucking like just like i wouldn't expect you to subscribe to somebody who you weren't actually going to watch i've done it <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yes and his name is peter like, day i, I like <laughs> them gonna... but i'm I'm not gonna uh, watch I'm them. I'm just gonna unsub from the Shock Mouse vlog. Yeah. All right, name bye. is Peter Day. <laughs> <laughs> no, well, sorry, Pete, what were you saying? Before uh, you were yeah, getting we'll out your co- baseball we'll card, YouTube is. <laughs> so, what, so basically, right, Zaptai was like the, the most popular subscriber that I had. I, I, I think he's sub to Chimp as well. Um, genuinely yes. brilliant YouTuber, like fantastic videos that he's made, very, very interesting and very sort of intellectual. The video that he did about face reveals and stuff, uh, making it um, the point that it is certainly unique to being a YouTube thing was like really interesting to watch. Um, and then literally, I think it was what, last week was it Chimp? That uh, Hot Wet Soup, which is the podcast that he stars in with uh, Bionic Pig and Elvis the Alien. Uh, came out with an episode saying that uh, basically they're killing off the podcast because um, he's being diagnosed with being a sociopath and he's been keeping things quiet and going behind their backs and stuff. Uh, but only recently it's come out that he might actually also be a paedophile. Oh, paedophile, a bit of a strong word. I'm going to say predator. Yeah. Well, so I see this is two word... separate things, right? Because one came out first and then the paedophile one came out second. Yeah, the word, so pe- the word paedophile on listen, their own. Listen, the word paedophile has been thrown around by everybody, so that's what I'm going to call it for now. Because that's right, what... Well, every, that's I, what I'm going to... You'll see, you're literally, I'm you're say the predator. word Zaptite and paedophile in the same sentence, right? Yeah, yeah. No, no, I'm not disagreeing with you, but I'm going to I'm gonna say predator. Yeah. And um, that's, that's, that's uh, that only... Because as far as I know, it's the, the, these girls that he's apparently been speaking to uh, and sending pictures to are 16... That's illegal in the United States, that kind of shit. But over sure. here, over here in England, sixteen is the consensual age for sex. Yeah, I believe. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not wrong, am I, Pete? Do you know what? <laughs> it's it is I don't sixteen, think you'd have a isn't it? And in chip, Germany, I really don't think you'd have a problem. Do you know yeah. what? <laughs> in in other places of Europe, it's it can be as low as fourteen. So yeah, it's um, if if you go to Japan, it's thirteen. Thirteen. Really? So, yeah. Yeah. So the, for the... yeah. As soon as you're yeah, a teenager. Yeah, yeah, it's as low as 13. You can get married in, in parts of Asia. You can get married at 13, can't you? Yeah. And stuff like that. But then you get so, situations. Sorry. Yeah, so for me, Zaptai, you know, he's kind of a... It's because of the, his location, he's being maybe more punished than what he would if he was over here. Yeah. For it. And they, they so they're throwing away around this paedophile allegation. The when word... I would say more predator. He's, he's taking advantage of his... A position of having quite a lot of uh, teenage fangirls and he's taken advantage of that position so I'm going to say more predator than a paedophile go on <laughs> yeah there is a, there is an actual word um, uh, for uh, wait it, okay I, I'm here to say it now he's definitely not a paedophile right because paedophile is children when you're a teenager you're a teenager right so do you imagine three bands you have child teenager adult right 
as far yeah. as as yeah. far as the law goes, um, it's uh, uh, it's paedophilia when they are twelve and under. When it's uh, above that, it's a word that never gets used, which is called uh, fo. Uh, I can't even pronounce it. Uh, fo bo filler or something. I'll, I'll spell it out. E p h e b o p h i l i a. Ebola. I'm gonna I'm gonna get the computer to speak. It. <laughs> Ebola. <laughs> Ebola. Gonna, quite quiet, quiet a second. I'm gonna get the computer to read it. And I'm gonna try and repeat what it says. Fo apparently. Ephobophilia. Yeah, Ephobophilia. that's when that's when you have um, <coughs> that's when it's it's between fifteen to nineteen apparently, and there is another one called hebophilia, which is between eleven to fourteen. Right, you can see why people just say paedophile because fucking no, no one's going yeah, to say those ones don't really, say. Those ones yeah, don't really roll off the tongue, but do they? Paedophile <laughs> isn't correct. That's what I'm saying. Is it no, in not, the eyes no. of in the eyes of the, of, the, of the law? You, like people who are attracted to like let's say this band are no longer classed as paedophile, but they are classed as a sex offender. You might say. Yeah, it's a yeah. buzzword at the end yeah. of the day. It's a yeah. buzzword for people to click on fucking videos, and so is that word sociopath, as far as I'm concerned. Yeah. Right. You put they. Yeah, that's you know, what I was they, saying. Was two separate things. Yeah. Yeah. In that podcast, they use that fucking word and they drown that fucking word out quite a bit. He's a sociopath. He's a sociopath. Um. Maybe, maybe not. Number yeah. one, he said he told you he was, so he told yeah. you he was diagnosed. He told you, yeah, you know, uh, he didn't get a second opinion. He could just be lying. <laughs> yeah. yeah. The, what, listen, uh, listen, listen. There was a sociopath lie. There is a, yeah, there is people a people actually lie on the on the on the internet shop mouth. They lie. They do. There is a correct way and a wrong way to handle things. Okay, the correct way would be to put out, let's say, a statement saying due to like on twitter due to uh internal issues uh hot wet soup has been discontinued until further notice yeah. yeah instead what they did is they paraded in a 50 minute i'm sure it was monetized as well zap ties uh, no it wasn't i don't think it was monetized I'll, I'll double check for you quickly uh but they yeah. paraded in a, in a 50 minute video it again might have been actually saying about that um uh, about Zaptai being um, having all of these issues. Yeah. Hang on, I'm just checking if it's monetized or not. Uh, no, it's not monetized. No. Um. Yeah. Yeah. So yeah, they did that. That's that's not. That's, that's pretty shit. I mean, that's a pretty shit thing to do just there anyway. Yeah. And they they literally threw him under the bus because yeah. of it. You know. But didn't they also really... say, "Oh, but he's our friend still." Isn't that what? Yeah, and then certain members they, said. But then you go yeah, on and Twitter, they... and yeah. people like I'm Alex and stuff, and, and uh, what was it, Bionic Pig, or it might have been Elvis yeah. Alien? Would help if Twitter didn't keep fucking breaking. I think it's more Bionic Pig. I think Elvis the Alien really just uh, he did the podcast and then sort of stepped away a lot more from Twitter and didn't really comment on it anymore. It's yeah. mostly been that I'm Alex guy. Yeah. He was yeah. the one that broke it, wasn't it? Wasn't he the one that Zaptai went and told, and then Alex went and ran to the other two? Um, is yeah, that what happened? Because the thing is, him and um, I'm Alex and Tommy C got into a fight about this. Um, yeah. Uh, basically, uh, somebody called um, uh, at uh, at Diodor Anthony said, "Haha, Zaptai sent and received news from underage girls." Ironic uh, that the man. Um, Ironic for the man who made two videos on predatory YouTubers, God funny as hell, right? And mm. I'm Alex, then quoted that tweet and tweeted it to, at Tommy C. Hey, Tommy C, did you send your dick to underage girls too? Multiple would have been even better. A response would be nice. And then he tweets, mm. I take no enjoyment in this. Truth's out there now. I lost my best friend and he harmed friends and lied to me. Title doesn't excuse the actions. It's such a mess, isn't it? Yeah. It's unbelievable. I actually uh, agreed with a lot of how Tommy C approached that argument because, there, you know, there was a lot of, oh, uh, we didn't know about the girls. Uh, yeah, well, you kind of hinted that you did know, really, in the podcast. Yeah. But there was more to the story. You were hinting that quite a bit. Um, and if you did know, you should have gone to the police. It shouldn't have been on fucking YouTube. It should be put into the public sector. And obviously with Alex tweeting out that um, if you make a video on uh, Ed, Zap yeah. Tai, uh, you're done in this community. And that, that actually got up, up my nose. And I actually like just I 
I was gonna respond, but I thought, no, I'm gonna fucking, I'm a small now. I was gonna take my notes to me. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna leave it. But Tommy, Tommy C, just fucking really pissed him off and all, and he really just went for the for the jugular. Yeah. Because did they you, put did it you into watch the Tommy C's, sector. Did you watch Tommy C's stream stroke podcast on it? I did. Yeah. Yeah. Um, they put it in the public sector, right? And that gives anyone the right to talk about it. That is yeah. in the public. They put it in the public sector for that reason. Yeah. They want people to fucking talk about it. Otherwise, yeah. why do that it? That was the weird thing. The weird logic was the, they said the reasoning why they came out and and made that episode and said it was so oh because someone else will talk about it. So we're going to beat them to it. So now yeah, no one's allowed to talk about it. Yeah, well, of yeah, course people are going to talk. We about want it. the attention. Yeah, because we want the attention. So if they didn't approach, if they didn't approach it, it would have come out eventually, some way or another. That stuff like that's not going to be hidden. Some yeah. way or another, that would have come out. They wouldn't have even been involved. Yeah, right. They wouldn't have had to go through all the hassle they've gone through. Uh, I personally lost a bit of respect. I lost a lot of respect for Iron Alex, but I lost a bit of respect for Bionic Pig yeah. and LC yeah. Alien too. I lost um, a lot of respect for Iron Alex. Yeah, uh, but for yeah. Iron Alex, I find him quite. I did. I did think there was something a little bit off with him, but I find him quite sly now when I look at him. Like yeah. there's, there's a, there's another agenda going on there. Yeah. Like with him, you know, and that agenda yeah. is quite simple. I want more subs. I want more money. I want attention. It's and he's like, and he's not. He's not gonna. Members. He's not gonna stop to th- uh, like worry about throwing people under the bus to get there. You know. Yeah. Yeah. The that's... whole internet sensation thing that he has on his shirts and stuff. Yeah. I thought that that was like a meme or a joke. But now it's coming across like it's very real. Like yeah. he very <laughs> really thinks that. Yeah. It's like, oh, dude, <laughs> yeah. dude. And then I only and, and he turned eighteen just the other day. I'm like, holy shit. Here's the thing, though. He's he's just a product of the system. Like he is a small YouTuber. He gets noticed by Power Cynical. He blows up, and all of a sudden the ego kicks in. He thinks he's this. You know, he thinks he knows it all. He's fucking 18, 17, 18 years old. He knows fuck all at that age. He was six years old when I opened my YouTube account. Okay. Exactly. <laughs> Let's put life, that perspective. Of yeah, how life guy will is. kick him Jesus into touch Christ. at some point, like it has all of us. Like yeah. us older YouTubers. And like Tommy C's an older YouTuber, and he said it how it was. Yeah. This is, if this, if you knew any of this, it should have gone to the police. You shouldn't be bringing it out into the public. You're just throwing them under the bus. This yeah, stuff would have this... come out without your help. You're doing it for the wrong reasons. There's a hidden agenda. End of story. <laughs> yeah. The second that you have a serious allegation and you go to YouTube or the public before the police, you've instantly lost a lot of um, believability in it. Especially yeah. then if you go to the police, if you then go to the police, the police themselves are probably going to say, well, why didn't you come here before you did that? Absolutely oh, spot yeah. on, dude. Absolutely spot on. I mean, um, I did. Uh, I did hear a rumor that the uh, I don't know what's floating around that the police are actually investigating this issue now. Did anyone else hear yeah, that? Yeah, and they have the power to like sniff out the evidence that like the everyday Joe can't. Like they can get warrants to search. Yeah. Uh, yeah. In it, histories and phones and sh- and stuff like that. Yeah. Yeah. Like they, because if of it where... has happened, they will find out. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, yeah, and because of where Zaptai is, he might be in a bit of trouble for it. Yeah. You know, where he might not have been if he was in England or Europe or Asia, you know, where the laws are different. Was it was it over there in Australia? Oh, well, yeah, I wanted to ask you guys if it's like here, right? Because did he send dick pics? Did he do that's that? That's the claim. Well, I'm going to say well, that's, that's the claim. claim. Okay, because over here, no 16 is the age of consent, but until you're 18, it's still considered child pornography. So you can give consent for... To, to do things sex as uh, 16, 17 yes that but <laughs> if you take a, even if you take you it can't of say yourself, sex <laughs> if you're 16, 17 and you take it of a picture of yourself naked you can be charged I don't know if they've updated the law but at some one point you could be charged with manufacturing child pornography even if it's of yourself yeah, now, <laughs> I would say that that was I would say that that's probably the same here Pete what do you reckon I think yeah. it is isn't I it? think so yeah yeah so that's where the, the issue is so if that if those I mean, I hear that the uh, I hear that the photos that she sent him weren't even naked ones. She was in like a bra and stuff and her pants. She was she wasn't naked. Yeah. So that's not porn. That's not technically pornography, is it? That's just uh, erotic pictures, I suppose. Or, yeah. You know, so there's definitely an investigation needed. Yeah. Uh, whether, you and know, as far cause... as that is concerned, right now it's just total radio silence. So I'll be interested to see yeah. what comes out of this. It's the best thing to do, but when, at the end of the day, and it's a shame to say it, Zaptoy is fucked now, either yeah. way. 
his that, reputation that his career is has fucked. basically been killed. Yeah, either way, even if it was innocent, even if it was all innocent and it was just a, a, a stupid 19-year-old kid making a silly mistake, which is probably what it was. Yeah. Let's face it, he's probably just gotten a little bit excited, a little bit of attention, you know, a little bit of flirting. Gone a little bit far one night, maybe a couple of drinks involved. Yeah. Whatever, you know, it's gone down this bad route, someone's found out, blah, 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 and it's all like, it's all just blown into this shit, shit ball, mm. you know. But either way... Even if he's found innocent, because of YouTube being the way it is, he is fucked. Unfortunately, like, Chimp, are... Chimp, unfortunately, when it comes to the internet nowadays, if Keemstar has anything to go by, a lot of people want to cause uh, upset uh, and ill will towards people because it's profitable. Hmm. And, I, and I, I, yeah, I hate that side of it so much, yeah. Pete, you know that. Yeah. <laughs> and when I said to you, I really hate the internet, I wasn't actually referring to, like, I was generally upset that Zapti done it. Don't get me wrong. Like yeah. generally disappointed. Oh, me in too. The guy. Me too. Me too. Because I've spoken to the to the I've spoken to the guy once, twice. Yeah, on, I I, I haven't spoken and... to him. Like he doesn't follow me on Twitter. He follows you on Twitter, but yeah. like he watch. I know he watches my stuff. Yeah, and he's DM'd me a few times, uh, and that, and seemed like a really nice guy. Yeah. So I was generally disappointed. Yeah. Uh, in him, but. You know, it's just uh, you're looking at it from all angles. It's yeah, just a, it's just a big mess. Like he's yeah. got himself yeah. into a massive mess, and he'll never recover from it. And I think maybe the best thing he should probably do is probably leave the internet, uh, get on with his life. Maybe come back in a few years. The internet maybe forgets. The internet like definitely forgets. Yeah, uh, uh, yeah, 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 it can forget very. And quickly. learn from it. At the end of the day, learn from his mistakes. You yeah, know, you got to learn from your mistakes. But yeah. yeah, he needs to. He needs to probably disappear for now. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, like Mel Gibson's nominated for an Oscar this year, I'm pretty sure, isn't he? I mean, that took, what, eight years or something, but he's Heck still come back. And people thought he mouse. was never going to come back. Hey? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Where did Mel Gibson come from? We're just talking about Mel Gibson. Fuck it. Well, yeah, he was a guy, I remember, yeah. eight years ago. Story right? time. He, he it's time was... where we're at. No shock, Mel's no. No, story time. Talk to the hand. Let's have this. Like, we're going to do story time now. We're going to have some laughter at this very heavy I didn't, episode. I didn't talk to the very no. heavy I'm going to explain why that makes sense. Don't you dare, Chimp, or I will do it to you too. No. Mel Gibson's reputation was soiled eight years ago, and no one thought he would ever make a comeback from that. That is how it's relevant. That is how it's relevant. Shock mouths. Shock mouths. Talk to the hand. Talk to the hand. Right, now you can speak, Pete. Talk to the hands of shock valves. Yeah. <laughs> right, okay, I'm you... back. I'm back. Shot mouse is now on talk to the hand. Shot mouse is now on talk to the hand. For <laughs> <laughs> oh, fuck's sake, that threw me off. <laughs> I had to lap it. <laughs> right, uh, we're going to do story time now. Yeah. Heavy conversations, heavy topics. I want to laugh. Fuck this shit. I want to laugh. Yeah, Can't I want to laugh. Story time. Explain. I want to laugh. Right. Okay. I'll I'll introduce it when Shot Mouse comes back. Okay. Because Shot Mouse is such a cunt. I don't know where Mel Gibson came into it, but what fucking ever. I know, I think I understand the link, but he stretched that link. Shot Mouse, you're fucking... back. I did not stretch it, and if you listen to me, you would get it. Story time! It's a time where we're writing a story. We're sending it to Penguin Books. Every podcast, we write a chapter uh, by each saying a word. Each and these chapters will consist of paragraphs anyway. Um, so, uh, to give you any... Uh, give you a... Fuck, I can't even fucking say things today. To give you fucking guidance about what the uh, chapters are like, here's chapter 17, Avocado Vaginas, which we wrote last time on Talk to the Hand. <clears throat> this is with special guest Mush. Mush! President Trump fucked Shot Mouse internally. Harder! Screamed Shot Mouse internally, secretly, into a bucket of chowed air. Becky boobs, <laughs> boobs, boobed bouncily, boing bounding hardcore porn addict. Cinemas excellently have popcorn and chowder. Wanking my Shot Mouse anus. Avocados fetish excites Mush. He likes avocados vaginas. They spew avocados juices. Scissors cut things like foreskins off easily, Jewishly, circumcisingly, goodly, and avocadoily. Juicily, ava- ad- objectively. Shit. I've shit shock mouth shit. Why avocado juices run down my shaft? 
Craigslist is really gay, except on Wednesday, when avocados are moist and soggy. Rice gum penetrates fun bum from behind, just anally leakage. That was chapter 17, avocado vaginas. Chapter 18. That was such a bad, bad week. (laughs) Yeah. None of that made fucking sense. (laughs) No. I thought it was great. We just smashed together sentences into, so it made nothing. Yeah. Like, that's, that's, that's just a pure ear cancer, that was. Just, just ear rape. Oh, right. right. Who's that's starting? That's offensive to people who have cancer in the year. <laughs> <laughs> who's starting and, and who's going next? You are, because you opened. Oh, who opened? No, you opened. I, no, who opened? I did. All right, I'll go. Are you sure you, you want me to You did open. Peter did in the end. <laughs> well, I'm going first. Then Peter, then you. Right. Bye. Okay. All right. All right. Zap tie. <laughs> Fuck's sake. Oh no! <laughs> I did it. Oh no! <laughs> oh no! Just say died, and then it'll be done. <laughs> <laughs> Kill the character off. <laughs> Right, no, no, no. Zaptai looked <laughs> dead. <laughs> Worried. Sorry? Worried. Worried. <laughs> About <laughs> what people <laughs> thought of him. Full stop. Let's never go back yes. to that sentence again. We got how that lovely. <laughs> Shock mouse. Yeah. Death. <laughs> Was imminent. <laughs> Full stop. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> Christ! <laughs> Zaptai died. <laughs> <laughs> oh, for fuck's sake! <laughs> I'm gonna take a long. No, I'm gonna. No, I'm gonna take a long holiday from this podcast. All right. Zaptai, if you're listening, I'm very sorry that, we, that I don't want you to die. It just it was just a story. Okay, it's fictional. <laughs> Oh no, it's real, Shock Mouse! It's fucking real! <laughs> you knob! <laughs> right. Is it me? Yeah. Shock Mouse? Climbed. Climbed? <laughs> climbed. You said climbed. Oh, no, sorry, I thought you said, cl- cr- said crimed. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, that doesn't even Climbed make a fucking, any fucking sense. Climbed. <laughs> um, mount. Kill. Zap tie. <laughs> what? <laughs> Full Grandma stop. Kill zap tie. Full stop. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> I'm Alex. <laughs> I'm, <Rob. laughs> I'm Alex. <laughs> right. <laughs> Um, looked gay. <laughs> Full stop. <clears throat> Peter didn't care <laughs> about. Shock mouse. Wife. <laughs> Being. <laughs> Sorry? Being. B E I N G. Being. Um. Sane. <laughs> Full stop. Bionic pig. Died. 
Full stop. <laughs> I'm just killing off the entire hot wet suit crew. Yeah. <laughs> One person at a time. Shock mouse. <laughs> Don't kill me off. <laughs> Died. <laughs> <laughs> it, wait, not inside. <laughs> Sorry? <laughs> inside. 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 Shock Mouse died inside. <laughs> Anus. Oh, for fuck's sake. <laughs> hey, you use it so much. The alien. The alien. <laughs> what? The anus, the alien. <laughs> <laughs> Cousin. Because. Oh, I did, what did Shock Mouse say? Cousin. You just and I, said cousin. Be, I said because. <laughs> Family. Full stop. <sighs> lazy with these. This is not a sentence. These are three words together. It's full stop. Full stop. It's time for the hero. It's time for the hero of the book. Yeah. Becky. <laughs> Becky. Bounced. Oh, Towards. Sorry? Towards. Towards. Carcasses. <laughs> of. Uh, H-W-S. Of H-W-S. Oh, yeah. Sorry, I was just like, I can't say hot wet soup. Is that one word? I don't know. Well, if you said hot, if you said hot, I was going to say soup. Oh, uh, no, sorry, hot. wet. <laughs> God damn it. I don't know um, what the fuck it's called. <laughs> Becky. <laughs> Becky bounced towards carcasses. Of hot wet soup. H-W. Of, of hot we'll wet soup. we just say soup. hot wet soup when we figure, yeah. Just, he knows what it means, so he can say hot wet soup. <laughs> um... Uh, pick a word, shot mouth, for fuck's sake. Smushing. Her. Pick a word, smushing. Her. <laughs> Chip, it's you. Uh, Chip, it's hey. you. It's you. I didn't hear what. I didn't hear what the other word was. Her. H e r. Smushing her. Uh, cleavage. <laughs> Against the chimp. Oh. <laughs> Anus. <laughs> Anus. <laughs> Shock mouse. <laughs> Licks. Uh, do I go dirty or do I go safe? <sighs> Is that licks or licked? Licks. Uh. Licks. Licks. I'm Alex's. <laughs> oh, I'm going for iron, ironic humour here. Uh, I. Damn it. <laughs> um. Bull. Full I was stop. supposed to say tongue, Peter. You were supposed to say tongue. It would have been ironic because he has a long tongue. Oh, you such an anus. Uh, Peter. Day. Laid. Pipe. <laughs> Full stop. <laughs> I just imagine being a fucking hard hat just trying to do some fucking plumbing work. <laughs> Do you guys it's fucking mind? <laughs> where are my fucking, where are my fucking high vis? <laughs> YMCA. Right. Come people. <laughs> oh, is it me? Yeah. Suddenly. <clears throat> Boogie. <laughs> two nine eight eight. <laughs> Or did you say two nine eight eight? Yeah. Uh, we'll treat it as oh, one okay. word. We'll treat it as one word. All right. So <laughs> suddenly, boogie two nine eight eight. Um. <laughs> um. Appeared. 
in spandex. <laughs> Full stop. He looked like fabulous. He looked like fabulous. <laughs> Monkeys throw. Sorry. Shit. Sorry. Throw. Chip. Grow. Throw. Grow. Shit. All right. Full stop. And that's chapter eighteen, everybody. <laughs> right. Okay. Zaptai looked worried about what people thought of him. Death was imminent. Jesus Christ! Zaptai died! Shock Mouse climbed Mount Kill Zaptai! I, Malix, looked gay! Peter didn't care about Shock Mouse's wife being sane! Bionic Pig died! <laughs> Shock Mouse. Bionic <laughs> Pig died! Shock Mouse died inside Anus the alien's cousin because family. Becky bounced towards the carcasses of hot wet soup, smashing her cleavage against the chimp's anus. Shock mouths licks I'm Alex's eyeball. Peter Aww. Day laid pipe. Full stop. <laughs> Suddenly, Boogie 2988 appeared in spandex. He looked like fabulous monkeys. Grow shit. <laughs> Hey, I'd like to point out a plot hole in the story, okay? I died. My character died, but then my character, <laughs> while dead, licked Alex. Yeah. That doesn't it, make you sense. You died inside! It was a spasm, okay? <laughs> <laughs> something which you're this. fucking cute. Like, something which you fucking do quite often. You <laughs> smash my knee on this bloody table when I laugh hard. <laughs> <laughs> That's how Shot Mouse gets around, just by a sort of uh, collection of spasms. <laughs> like Jim Henson's Co Creature Shop. Collection of spasms, oh, also known as... It's the, the Shock Mouth Mouse Podcast! Yay! It's happening. <laughs> he says that to the missus when they're about to have sex. Yeah. It's happening. <laughs> it's happened, I'm Poor Mrs. Bye. Shocks. Bye. All I can say is poor Mrs. Shocks. It's happening. She's fine. Can, can we get her word on it that she's fine? She's asleep right now. Oh, don't read to too much into that. Tell, in the next in the next <laughs> vlog, tell her to knock twice. Yeah. <laughs> Let us know that she's safe. Well, she's awake now. <laughs> 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 right. Thank you, everyone, for listening to Talk to the Hand, the podcast of the criminally insane. We're just going to keep that as our fucking catchphrase now. We don't have a business card. I like, I like the mentally insane, not the criminally insane. Oh, no, we're, we're criminals. Not criminal. we're, flip. we're not fucking criminals. Smooth criminals. Yeah, no, we're fucking criminals, all right? That's the other podcast. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh! <laughs> speaking, oh! Speaking of which... <laughs> speaking of which... Speaking of which... When am I coming on the um, to, uh, Shop Nights podcast as a special guest? <laughs> oh, yeah. March. March. Just let me move house. All right. Let me you... move house. Okay. And then you can come on. Right. Words need to be said. <laughs> okay. Words need to be said. <laughs> <laughs> You're on. All right. See you guys later. Bye. <laughs> Bye. 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 Hi, Peter Day here. We forgot to name the episode. This episode is called Die Zap Tie. <laughs>